come prepared for defeat. What's going on, everybody? Codemaster Hard Rock back at it again with a brand new pack opening. This time, I'm doing uh, something I never thought I'd ever get around to, but it's Alliances Unraveled. This is the last set to be printed by Chaotic and the game before, you know, its demise. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to make... I've took a lot of criticism, so I'm going to follow through. If you want to go ahead and read the card lore, go ahead and pause it right now to read that little blue box. What we're going to do is we're going to get started on one on either side. So we're going to save the best character side for last and start with Maxor. So I'm going to try coming through these as fast and as best as I can while still maintaining the same energy and love that y'all know me for. Oh yeah, I forgot. So each pack had like a Shadow Warriors ad, but y'all know what time it is. Sniffing. Oh my. All right. So one dumb ad out of the way. We're starting with the sun top here. There we go. If you want to read the effects, go ahead and pause them as I reveal them. We have the Star Towers of Ken Sep. Pin in. I'm pulling them away so that way I don't have to edit as much. Battle Song of Depletion. One focus. There you go. Battle Song of Depletion. Oh, we got a super rare. Wrath Tab Mind Scryer. Ooh, okay. Well, for all the, like the big ticket guys, I'm going to read them off real fast. 70, 25, 80, 20, 35. Not too shabby. Oh my God, he's gorgeous. Then we have the Swaberton Battle Song. Again, if you want to read the effects, go ahead and pause them as I read off the names. Then we have Thark, uh, Tablet Translator. Then we have Dust Strike. Sun Chariot of Kensep and Tecto Strike. Okay. Already off to a pretty decent start. You know, we already got one super, so if that's a sign of things to come, then color me excited. Next pack. Now, I sniff every single pack. If anyone who watches my channel knows me will know, I will sniff every single pack. Oh, yeah. Okay. We have Donmar, Tablet Translator. Is there a tra Tablet Translator for uh, all the every tribe? That'd be cool. Then we have Sylv, Servant of Air. Anthem of Stone. We have a rare If Janin? If Janin. If John. If Janin. Whatever. Bam. There you go. Ooh. Counterpoint of Chaos. This was used in the show. I always thought that this was a really, really cool name. Ooh, we got three rares in this pack. Hello. We have Hyper Hover. Sandstorm Shroud, Turbulence Funnel, and Outfreeze. All right. We got three rares in that pack. Pretty nice. Can't complain about that. Next pack. Oh, my God. I might, uh... Save one of these packs and just call my fiance over to at least take a whiff of one of them. So we have Garip. We have the Riverlands Abandoned Wastes. Odu Banthax Reservoir Reclaimer. Ooh, we have the Ankh of Kensep. Equipped creature deals an additional five attack damage to creatures with no elemental types. For those of you who are running a Venna, uh, yeah, sorry. We have Inhun Kalen or Inhun Kalen, whatever. It's hard to pronounce some of these names. Ancestral Anthem. That's one way to activate Hive. Never seen that before. We have Air Salts, Citadel Lodestone, and Obscuring Winds. I would argue that 
Alliances Unraveled is probably the best set to have ever graced Chaotic in the entire game, right next to Turn of the Tide, probably. Um, yeah, so we're going to crack open the next guy. I'm just going to shut up and talk about the cards. <sighs> there we go. Tablet Sanctuary. Main? Mine? Mine. Diminuendo. This was a music that they used in season one. Don't know why it only came out much like. Oh my god! Oh my god! Nadrin High Muge of the Lake? An ultra rare! Oh baby! Oh baby! 50 courage, 40 power, 105 wisdom, 25 speed, 30 energy. My neighbors are but you know what? Whatever. Nadrin, baby, look at that. Oh, oh man, I just pulled the nuts. Earth shape? Rest in peace, headphones users. I apologize. Isaiah Mind Probe. We have Eidolon Advance, Citadel Lodestone, and Air Salt. Oh my god. You want to talk about the God Pack? Well, that was it, baby. It can only get better from here. If I pull the other High Muges, or even Jatani or Zamul, I'm going to lose it. But I wasn't even expecting that. Like, oh man. And these packs have, could still contain their 2000, 2000 smell. We have Donmar, Tablet Translator, Sylv, Servant of Air, Anthem of Stone. Ooh, a super retaliatory strike. Pretty nice. We have Song of Translocation. Oh my god. I'm trying to like get it so that way you guys can see without the pictures without blinding myself. We have Arthoa, Captain of the Azoa. Mineral Mayhem, Flood Force, and Sandstorm Shroud. Oh my god. It's... Oh my god. This is the, uh, the god opening. The god. Or should I say the high muge opening. The Kothika opening. I'm going to stop sniffing packs for you guys, but I will save one for my fiancé to smell. Howl of the Wind. Mock Aiden. A uh, fluid master. Sirent. Sir, Sirin, sorry. Servant of fire. We have Gundok. Gundok. Silent Requiem. Then we have Mipidum Valley. Dust Strike, Sun Chariot, and Tecta Strike. Next pack. That was a bit savage. We have the Riverlands abandoned here. I'll get a little closer. Bam, there we go. See, that's much better. That's what I should have been doing. Riverlands abandoned wastes. We have Odu Banthax. The Storm Tunnel during the Lingering Monsoon. Another Gundak. A Silent Requiem. Mipidum Valley. Ooh, okay. Fire Ram, Sudden Flare, and Clean Slide. I'm a huge fan of Fire Ram. I play Underworlders. Should be no brainer why I like that card. Siren. Servant of Fire. Ooh, Nom, Servant of Earth. We're only missing the Overworld one, which is Servant of Water. I can't remember her name. Battle Song Renewal. Ooh, another ultra rare. Falmacken. Isaiah Inquisitor, 2540-90-2555. When he deals attack damage, I may immediately play a Mugic card of cost two or less without paying its Mugic cost. Oh, baby, is that a good pull. Oh, my God. Fluid Flame. Swaburton Battle Song. Aquatic Familiar, Meditative Leap, and Consuming Flame. 
Oh, my sweet merciful. We are just pounding out these. You know what? Maybe maybe the K-Or side uh, will bring just amount of, the same amount of luck. Greep. Riverlands, Abandoned Waste. Odoo, Banthax. Tarantula, Tarantula, sorry. <laughs> Tackle. Ooh, Magmon Engulfed. Not a super ultra, but definitely an awesome card. Ooh, one that I've actually been after, Drill Dozer. Sweet. Okay, this is immediately going in one of my decks. I'm going to set you aside. Silent Requiem, Out Freeze, Sun Chariots, and Tech to Strike. Still can't get over how many Ultras I've pulled. You know what? For this one, I'm going to open up the Gates of Heaven, if I could do this properly. Oh, come on. You can do it. Oh, oh. All right, whatever. <laughs> I tried making it all pretty. I can't do it. So, real quick, let's talk about this ad. I was looking at the back of it. Uh, Enter the world of Chaotic, where Battle for Param has never been so intense. An all new story, battle over 40 creatures, 35 music spells, 30 plus pieces of battle gear, battle against your friends of multiplayer uh, capability. Not like uh, they had an uh, online website or anything like that where you could play the game. Uh, and supposedly it was available on Wii, Nintendo, DS, Xbox, and PlayStation. I have played the Wii, or sorry, the Nintendo DS, Xbox, and PS3. I'm just missing the Wii experience. Not too much different, I'm assuming. Elemental Counterpoints. Jod Dixite Defender. This is a very underrated card. If you ask me, Jod Dixite Defender is a really good Mopedian to use in a strike deck. Amblocks. Embolks. Savitza. I thought Savitza was really, really cool. Like, can we just get a quick close-up on that art? Savitza is so cool. Very cool. We have the Passage to the Overworld. Um, Hebek. Havek. Whatever. Then we have the Crawl Shard of the Staunch. Trying to organize my cards here. <laughs> Sudden Flame, Clean Slide, and Mysterious Claw Blade. Okay. Next pack. This video is already getting pretty long. <laughs> Somnort. There she is. Under Servant of Water. We have officially pulled all the servants of the elements. Elementaire. Another retaliatory strike. Look at that. Another counterpoint of chaos. Hyper Hover. Mineral Mayhem, Sandstorm Shroud, and Flood Force. All right. I gotta tell you what, man. These packs are pretty godly. Godly, 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 godly. Ugh, I had to smell at least one on the way. Domnar, tablet translator. I keep thinking that the camera's like right over here, not over here. Sylv, servant of air. Come on, focus. There you go. Anthem of Stone. Estimal. The Almanator. Mount Pillar Reservoir Liberated. 
And we have Mineral Mayhem, Flood Force, and Sandstorm Shroud. Very cool. What I'm going to do real quick is I'm going to try adjust. I think, yep, this is the way. This is the way. Even with a very almost perfect opening. Ah! Omar Perithian Racer. Get a little close, a little friendly. The Swaberton. We have Sanlas. The Phoenix Belt. Vacuum Hemisphere. Tharlan, Isaiah Spy. Afri, Sun Chariot, and Death Strike. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to comb through these packs and only talk about the big ticket guys. Odu Bantax. Storm Tunnel during the Lingering Monsoon. Savitza. Oh, this card was... We have an upside down pack, ladies and gentlemen. Drill Dozer. I officially got another one. Tarantula Tackle. Symphony of Shielding, and the rest is whatever. Next pack. Come on. We have Riverlands of Anna Wastes. Odu Banthax, Storm Tunnel. Ooh, a super rare. Hello. Yondak, Yondaf, sorry. Yondaf Symbiotic Infector. 60, 45, 65, 35, 50 at the beginning of each turn. If he's un, if Yondaf is uninfected, uh, infect it. Uninfect three creatures, deal 10 damage to target creature. All right, I mean, he's all right. Xenocentric Wrath, a very underrated attack. Ock of Kensep, and the rest. Okay. Jad, Emblox, Castle Rothrak, Fluid Flame, Swaberton Battle Song, Thark, Central Evaporation, Earth Pulse, and uh, Metabolic Overloader. Okay, the last pack of the Maxor pack. If we just want to take a quick second, look at that bad boy. Absolutely gorgeous. And for those of you who I know will flag me later, I'm sure y'all want to see this other side too. All the other information. Nine cards every pack, blah, 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 blah. Castle Rothrak, Hewn Kanan, uh, How the Wind, City of Ken Sep, If John, Counterpoint of Chaos, Infernal Claws, Mineral Mayhem, and Flood Force. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're moving on to the KOR side of things, aka the best side of things. I'm going to quickly gather all my wild advertisements, set them aside. Now, it's a brand new side. We gotta give it a good old sniff. <sighs> Sunlass, Discord of Flame, Hurkin, Ooh, Slufra, uh, Treacherous Translator, a super. Looking at 3550, 30, 30, 35. Pretty cool. Put them right over there. More upside down packs. Mippidum Valley, Katoon. Oops, probably saw that code. Uh, unless I censor it. Atmosphere, Aquatic Familiar, and Meditative Leap. Okay. I'm not asking to pull Zamul or Jatani, but I gotta tell you what, that would be awesome. Uh, I'm not even gonna try. 
Pitta. Ooh, okay. A super rare Rock River Canyon. We got all nice and friendly. Ooh, this is going straight to my tribalist deck. Rock River Canyon. Heck yeah. I'm going to use that for sure. Maglax, Phoenix Belt, Fire Ram, Sudden, Flame, and yada, yada, yada. Whatever. All right. By the way, stay tuned till the end of the video where I will announce the KR figure winner. Sunlass, Discord of Flame, Hurricane, Orb, Fasif, Wall of Flame, Air Eyes, Mineral, and Flip Force. I don't want this video being too long, guys. Here's what we're going to do. Ah, uh, the gates of heaven have been opened. <sighs> you want a whiff? <laughs> Man, look at that. I got it in, like, pristine condition. I might hold on to it like that. I don't know. I'm weird. Savitsa, Elemental Counterpoint, Jot. Oh my god gracious. Another super. Headmaster Ankija, Seeker of the Arts. 55, 40, 50, 140. Nuts. I don't know what just fell over, but that's okay. Tarantula Tackle, Symphony of Shielding, Tech to Strike, Inferno, Air Rise. Okay. All right, we got Unda, Elementaire, Donmar, Orb, uh, Fasif, Wall of Flame, Primordial Rage, Quantum Pendant, or sorry, um, Quarnium, Quarnium Pendant, and Fire Ram. I have opened quite a bit of packs. <laughs> The gates of heaven have been opened. Just like that. It smells incredible. We have Savitsa, Elemental Counterpoint, Jod, Flame Fright, Aurablot, uh, Bonding Battle Song, Aquatic Familiar, Meditative Leap, and Consuming Flame. Okay. Not too shabby, not too shabby. I got a whole lot of sleeving up to do at the end of this. <laughs> Good thing I bought a bunch. They're really cheap. Castle Rothrak, Hewn Kanan, Howl of the Wind, Vacuum Hemisphere, Tharlan Isaiah Spr uh, Spy, Unbalancing Battle Song, Orcus Undin, Smoke Surge, and Rain Spears. Next pack. Anthem of Stone, Ulmar, Fluid Flame, Swaverton. Awesome. Okay. Ulmar, Perithian Racer. Swaverton, Sunless. Eroding, Empowering Encore. And that's it for that pack. Okay. I'm trying to get this open. <laughs> Elemental Counterpoint, another Jod, and Blocks. All right. I'm just going to comb right through these. Let's see. How many packs do we have? One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine packs left. My lucky number. You know what? What I'm doing right now is I'm seeing if I feel, this is going to sound stupid, but the energy of the packs. This is the only one that stood out. So, we're going to open this one first. Come on, Brian Gannon. Oh, it's already bent right there. No! 
Oh man, look at that. It's all. Oh well. Savitza, Passage, Flame Breach, Crack. You know what? At least there wasn't a super ultra in this pack, man. That's a shame. Discord of Flame, Hurricane Unda, Phoenix Belt, Vacuum. I think I've exhausted the powers of my super and ultra pulls. We did pull one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine super slash ultra. So, if I don't pull any more, that'll make sense. M blocks. Porthen! Porthen's cool. Smoke Surge. I forgot what you do. If engaged creature... Okay, real quick. So, just so you guys know what I'm talking about. If engaged creature has fire, deal zero. Okay, for a zero build... Yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Almar, Perithian Racer... Uh, the Garden, Ninren, Song of Translocation. Okay. Dominion Window. Quan. Empowering. Ah! Nothing crazy. I already did pull the nuts with Nadrin, so... Omar. Sunglass. Buy motorcycle. This okay. I have to talk about this one because this card is really good. If you want to read its effect, go ahead and pause it and you'll know why it's good. And I shouldn't have set that one aside. Silk Shaw, Dry Touch, Aquatic Familiar, Meditatively, Big and Simplify. There is three packs left. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm like very nervous right now. Oh boy, this is um, this is it. I'm gonna do this one last. That was gonna be my for my honey to smell. So, manga you read right to left, normal uh, American read left to right. Let's go manga style. Uh, I was also told that it's pronounced Kuhn. Tell me if I'm wrong. Gareep. Nothing. <sighs> Here we go. Castle Hume. Oh my god! We got a super! The Golden Heptagon! Oh my god. I thought I exhausted all my superpowers. Oh man. Thought I exhausted all my superpower just now. Oh my god. That is 10 supers and ultras. Now, give me one second with this one. Hey, baby. So I told the people on my video that um, uh, I would let you crack open a pack and catch a whiff of it. All right. Because I know you like the smell of card packs. I do. <sighs> <laughs> That's gonna be a flipping meme. Probably. All right. Yes, it does smell very nice. All right. So, I, what I'm gonna what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get as about as f cover the code. Yeah, oh, be, yeah. be nice and friendly. Just cover the code. Yeah, got this guy. Thanks this for, guy. Thanks for showing off the code. Um. 
Fast enough. Fast, fast enough, I can barely see it on your screen. That's okay. Orb of Unda. And decomposition. Decomposition. All right. Obscuring winds. I know what that is. Yeah. Mineral mayhem. I also know what that is. And flood force. And flood force. All right. Well. Very nice. That wasn't the most wild pack, but uh, is there anything that you want to say to my viewers? Read my comic. <laughs> wow. Plugging yourself in, huh? I'm joking, obviously. You know what? My honey loved his Christmas gift. I'll throw <laughs> I'll throw in a link to Let's Be Villains. Yeah. It's not it's not even chaotic chaotic related, but I'll do it. Oh honey, you don't have to. Here, I give was me, joking. Here, give me a keys. Give me a keys. Alright guys, with that being said, that's pretty much the end of the video. Let's go over some of the highlight cards. We have the Golden Heptagon. Initiative power. Creatures may play music of any tribe or affiliation. I don't know what that last part's supposed to mean. The next card of talking is Headmaster Ankija, Seeker of the Art. 55, 40, 50, 140. Your other creatures with air cannot be targeted by opposing music or abilities. He's pretty darn nice. Might start using him in one of my decks. <laughs> then we have Rock River Canyon, Initiative Courage. Creatures with Earth have an additional 10 energy. Not too shabby. Definitely going into my tribeless deck. Then we have Slufera. Oh, I guess my battery's running a little low, but that's okay. Um, come on, focus. All right, whatever. Uh, 35, 50, 30, 30, 35. At the beginning of combat, sacrifice a battle gear equipped to your engaged creature. And if you do, that creature gets fire and fire five. It's one way to juice yourself up, I suppose. Then we have Yondaf, symbiotic infector. Sitting at 60, 45, 65, 35, 50. If be, at the beginning of each turn, uh, if Yondaf is uninfected, infect it. Uninfect three creatures, deal 10 damage to target creature. Not too shabby. And not only do we have one, but we have... Two, Retaliatory Strike, build uh, build three, five base. Uh, retaliatory Strike deals additional damage equal to the damage dealt by the last attack played this combat. So it's basically a reverse plus five. So let's say your opponent whips up some super uber massive attack. You could just whip it right back at him technically. Then we have Falmacken. Zaya Inquisitor. It's kind of hard to see. 25, 40, 90, 25, 55. Once he deals attack damage, I may, may immediately play a Mugic card at the cost of two or less without paying its cost. Pretty sweet. I'm going to save that the best pull for last. You already know what it is. Then we have Wrath Tab Mind Scryer. Sitting at 70, 25, 80, 20, 35. Discard a Magic card. Target creature with zero on any discipline loses an elemental type of my choice. There's better ways of using that ability, but, you know, whatever. Then we have the Showstopper. The absolute powerhouse pull. Nadrin High Muge of the Lake. 50, 40, 105, 25, 30. Nadrin pays one less Mugic to play cards, Mugic cards, up to a minimum of one. Just, oh my god, look at him. And I pulled this bad boy. I pulled two in my lifetime. But there you go, guys. That was Alliances Unraveled. If you had an excellent time watching this video, I'm glad you had a good time. Otherwise, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Stay tuned. I will announce the KOR figure right now. 
Alrighty. <clears throat> I've got all nine names of the Chaotic KOR figure giveaway winners. Now, if you see your name right here, you're in the market. You follow through the rules. So let's see who wins. The Sheriff 117, 117. I will reach out to you, buddy, and congratulations on the KOR figure. Catch y'all next time.